Hello, so me and Anna are going to go out and we're going to try out Miranda Nautica. Um, if you don't know about it, look online. It basically generates a random location, but it's supposed to take you to places where you think like you have an intention and you think it, and it takes you there. So here we go. Here's the app. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Probably not. <laughs> so send in location. Okay, we'll go for an anomaly. And what we're we gonna think of? Um You said beer earlier, we could try beer again. Beer, yeah. Beer. Just beer. Think about it. Think about it, thinking about it. No points detected. Oh, oh view with Google. Okay. That's weird. Okay, yeah, we have a location, so I will update you when we get there. See what we find, to see if there's anything to do with beer. So we've ended up in a random location. Different location, because it lost the first one. Uh, we picked beer again, and we're here. This is the spot here, apparently in this bush. Thought there might be a beer can or something. But what is there there, Anna? Uh, there's nothing. Absolutely nothing. So let's just wander up. Big hill. Yeah, yeah it was a big hill to get here. Anything in there? Anything in there? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Just, just in the middle of some flat. <laughs> yeah. Right, we'll try a different location and we'll update you. So, I've just got another location and it is literally like 30 yards away. So we'll see what this one brings. Okay, so we're going to try this again because one, we didn't really think of an intention. I've just realised, we've just walked down the street to try and find it. I've just realised it's literally a few metres from the last one where we were on the same street. And we know full well that there's nothing there. So I'm going to try again and we'll see where that gets us. So this is taking us down a random alleyway. <laughs> Not too far from the last one, actually. We have just found this. That's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, this time we're going to try this one. So we're going down there somewhere, and what was your intent for this one? Prison. Prison. <laughs> I was like, think of a random thing, so she said prison, so who knows what we'll find. We've got a nice view of the city though. Well, kind of the city's back behind us, but... So we're here, apparently it's in this building here, which obviously we can't get in, but it is student accommodation, so if you class that as a prison, then fair enough. You used brass founders. Brass got anything to do with prison? No. How about William? I'm going to search William Rowland because there's a building there. And I'm not entirely sure who no, he is. Are, I think we need William Bar Church. Rowland. I'm a fan. Metal supplier. Oh. That, that's not surprising. You put a supplier to prison, you never know. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah. Right, we'll try another one. Let's hope we get better luck this time. That's where it is. We're now heading just down that street. Yeah. No, it's only here. No, I know. I mean, we don't think it's big enough. Yeah. Well, so this time, what did we pick? Unique. Yeah. So, unique. Let's see what we get. Can I do this in Sheffield? Okay. <laughs> so, Pretty much here, here somewhere, here. here. Anything unique here? <laughs> A half empty bottle of wine, or empty bottle of wine. No. Really? Yeah. So yeah, pretty much around here somewhere. Um, hold on, what's that say? Boycott the, boycott the NSS. Whatever the NSS is. Anything unique? Any unique, unique stickers? stickers? There was weird shit like. Uh, but that's, not cool that's not unique. It's not unique. But I don't know. Pixel Rick. Mm. Might be. Uh, anyway, we're going to try a different one. What we've decided to do now though, because it keeps sending us on the most we can do. Oh, it's a bit windy. It keeps sending us on like 15 minute walks. So we're going to keep doing it till we get ones that are pretty close. Um, because where we are, there's just shitloads of hills. 
We don't want to walk up hills anymore. Anyway, catch up with you on the next one. So we just spotted this that's pretty much where the point was. The point's just there, somewhere up there. And I just spotted this. So yeah, don't listen to those who say you can't listen to the one that says you can. So I don't know if that says anything about being unique, like doing your own thing or whatever, but that's pretty cool. I wouldn't have found that otherwise. I did not know. I was actually behind a pub that's closed down recently, uh, and I've never even seen like this side of the building, like the back of it. So I wouldn't have even known that were there. So that's pretty cool. So I'm not going to film that much around here because it's basically centres in between like loads of hospital buildings. Um, this time, what did we pick? Scary. She so picked scary. <laughs> so we're thinking sure it's going to take us to the you. morgue or something. I know people find hospitals scary, but we are in the day, so. Let's see, uh, we'll be there in a minute, so let's okay. see where it takes us. Okay, so the spot is basically right there in between those buildings. I'm not going to go there because it's private, but the hospital itself does look pretty creepy. Um, but also, I've noticed that the sign there does say um, therapeutics and palliative care. So I don't know if you know what palliative care is, but palliative care is basically the care you get given before you're going to die. So, but is that yeah. scared? Like, yeah, it's definitely. Well, yeah, scary, it could. I suppose it could. Yeah, and there's nothing at that location. I mean, maybe at night. Like, you sure that's not the entrance to the mall? There's mosque? nothing. It's probably in that bush. Like, there's a broken wall. Nothing, yeah. really. I can't see anything else around. Academic radiology. Yeah, we're basically just all these buildings around here are like uni buildings that do different things for the hospital so like the research and yeah um yeah anyway um i think we're gonna pop for a drink now and then we might try a few more <laughs> so we're now we, we followed our adventure for a bit to get a beer <laughs> it's very good beer too we are gonna continue later on when it gets dark to see what we find this time <laughs> who knows probably absolutely nothing <laughs> no idea right no idea. cheers so we're back from our adventure um what you saw is pretty much what we found not a lot um it is dark now we did briefly come back home wait a bit and then go out again in the intent of finding something creepy um, but after we'd wandered a bit on our own without using Randonautica, uh, we got too tired and came home. <laughs> um, yeah, now we did see a creepy, so where we live, there's a emergency services museum, which is apparently haunted. Uh, so we wandered down, obviously couldn't get in or anything, cause, you know, it's night time and it's shut. Um, but we did see in kind of like a courtyard area bit to it and behind the railings from across the street I wish I'd have took a video or something now but there was a cloth and it looked really like a wraith um, and we wandered closer and it turned out to be just a tarp covering a fire engine or something but I don't know what it was um, but yeah that was pretty much it and then we had a wander and uh, decided to just call it quits um, so yeah, I do plan on doing more of these type of videos, just random exploring, because why not? And uh, yeah, so hope you enjoyed this brief little video, and uh, yeah, see you next time when we do some more random exploring around the city. Yeah.